Hi, this is a demonstration of Raspberry Pi based uh, speaking bus stop indicator project. So, this is a bus stop indication system that is uh, whenever a bus reaches near a particular bus stop, it automatically detects which uh, bus stop it has uh, reached and it speaks out the bus stop name. So, whenever a new bus stop is added to the route or a bus changes a stop, it does not need to reconfigure entire system into the bus. We have a you know bus stop indicator unit placed in uh, placed on uh, every bus stop, and whenever the bus reaches any particular stop, it uh, transmits the bus stop name or number, and based on that uh, info, based on the bus stop number, it automatically checks uh, you know which bus uh, bus stop it has reached, and it speaks out the name. Of the bus stop as soon as it reaches a five meter distance so as soon as the bus reaches a five meter distance from the stop it automatically checks uh, which bus stop it has reached and it uh, speaks out the name of the bus stop so for this purpose as you can see we have a receiver unit here the receiver unit consists of a raspberry pi based circuit the raspberry pi is interfaced to an rf receiver to receive the transmitted signals along with an lc display and the speaker to speak out the bus stop name and here we have a transmitter unit the transmitter unit is uh, used to transmit the bus stop uh, number and uh, on this unit we have provided four uh, switches here the switches are used to vary the the switches are, the switches are used to vary the bus stop number so based on the combination of switches you uh, on and off it uh, indicates which bus, bus stop the bus has reached so we are use a binary structure where uh, this is currently indicating a zero when we switch the first bit when we switch the first bit to on this indicates a binary one 0001 and so on so this is how we indicate uh, 0001 0011 and so on so now let's do one thing let's turn on the system to see how it works raspberry pi based speaking bus stop indicator So the system has started now and it's giving us three options that is uh, whether to start the system that is start monitoring for bus stops in active mode. The second one is enter or edit bus stop names and the last one is uh, reset the entire system data. So let's see what happens if we start it without entering any data. So we you use the to set bus stop names first. So we Press use the. To go back. You have to set bus stop names first. Press enter to go back. So we use this keyboard here, which is connected to the Raspberry Pi, to transmit the, you know, text, or to send the commands to the Raspberry Pi based system. So now let's do one thing. Let's uh, go to the set bus stop names option and now we can see a menu here to add remove the names so let's uh, go to add so now let's uh, enter uh, name for uh, three bus stops so we'll first select three since we are going to enter three bus stops here so now let's uh, enter the first bus stop name Let's uh, enter, for example, Union Square. Then let's enter Victoria for second. And let's enter one. So now let's enter one more here. So we have entered the three names, now let's uh, press enter. So now the names have been added into a system, we can also use the remove option to remove the names. Now let's go back and 
let's do one thing let's uh, remove the power supply to the system first because whenever the system the receiver unit comes in range of any transmitter unit it is uh, going to sense that that bus stop is near and it will uh, you know speak out the name so we have to remove it when we start the system and it should be out of range so now let's uh, start it as you can see it is uh, showing that no bus stop is in range so now let's do one thing let's simulate that uh, the bus stop 0000 that is the first one is in range so now let's just connect this for uh, So as you can see, as soon as the first one was in range, since we had it to binary 0 to 0, it uh, spoke out the name of first bus stop. So now let's do one thing, let's uh, change the bit here. And uh, so now let's set the first bit here so that it will, uh, you know, speak out the name when the second bus stop is in range. So now let's do one thing, let's now connect the power to demonstrate as the second bus stop is in range. As you can see, it uh, spoke out the second name when in range. So now let's demonstrate for the next one. So now let's uh, simulate for a 3 that is 0010 0, 0, as you can see here. So So as you can see, uh, when we install this unit on bus stops and that, those in the buses, we can easily create a bus stop, uh, you know, notification system that automatically checks uh, which bus stop is in range and speaks out the name of the stop. So this is how the system works. Thank you.